The diet was the hardest thing to kind of wrap my head around. Tilapia and ground turkey. Broccoli, shredded coconut, and ground turkey. Oh, oh man. Woo. Oh, no. Oh. Stripping it down, being pretty basic. You know, I ate like six times a day. Oh, protein sweats. Burning fat and uh, leaning out. This is how much food Michael B. Jordan eats in just one day. What's going on, everyone? It's Asil Suede. Welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to be attempting Michael B. Jordan's Creed 3 diet. So the Hollywood gods have spoken, and they said, Asil, you got to try Michael B. Jordan's diet. Did they really? No, not really. But he is looking insane for his upcoming movie, Creed 3. And he's already looked really good in the past, but it seems like he's added more muscle mass this time. So I did some research to figure out what in the world his diet was. And apparently, he is eating six clean meals, over 350 grams of protein with 4,000 calories in just one day. So I'm going to be spending all night in the bathroom after this. Look, if you enjoy this video, do me one favor. Make sure you give the video a like right now. Seriously, do it now. I dare you. Please smash the like button. Okay, so I went grocery shopping to pick up all of the foods in Michael B. Jordan's Creed Day Diet. And this is pretty much everything with exclusion of the white rice and chicken breast that I already had. But check it out, guys. Rice, chicken, egg, ground turkey, broccoli, tilapia, egg whites, sweet potatoes, oh, meal. So I thought this was interesting. I pulled up the receipt on exactly how much all this food in bulk cost and it was right at $21.09. So obviously that excludes the chicken breast and the white rice. But if you bought that in bulk as well, like all these other items, it'd be probably around $30. And this would seriously last you all for an entire week. So you don't have to spend a lot of money when you're eating whole foods or making simple meals. So that's just like one big tip here. Look, at the end of the day, I don't need to achieve Michael B. Jordan's results. I do these videos for pure fun and entertainment. This is how I look like. This is where I started my fitness journey. Very happy with where I'm going and I've coached thousands if not tens of thousands of people to transform their physiques as well. So I just like to do these videos to really give you all tips with your own fitness journey and actual non-Hollywood stereotypical bro science. But with that being said, I'm gonna eat like a bro for a day. So wish me luck for meal number one. Plain oatmeal. <sighs> Gordon Ramsay would personally come kick my ass if he saw this. Just got done preparing meal number one and a few words that just come up to my mind when I look at this after I was done preparing it. Fear, disappointment, anxiety. I mean, we have a cup of white rice, six egg whites, one whole egg, along with a cup of plain oatmeal. Come on, man. Michael B. Jordan, you're like an A-list celebrity. I think you know how to make plain oats taste a little bit better. We also have the classic college meal here. I mean, this actually does remind me of college. Though. I used to eat eggs with rice all the time. It's actually not that bad. I know it looks crazy simple. Add some hot sauce to this, some salt, some pepper, and you're good to go. It really is not that bad. Like, a lot can change in life, but this will always taste the same. <laughs> I mean, even Michael B. Jordan is eating this. Okay, this is when fear is involved. I feel like I'm in an episode of Fear Factor. We have plain oatmeal. Do you guys eat plain oats? First of all, why do you do that? Second of all, how? Oh, holy oh man. Okay, that's all she wrote for meal number one. So I'm probably gonna wait about two hours then eat meal number two because six meals in one day is a lot. Like talk about meal frequency. I typically eat around three meals a day, maybe like one snack, sometimes even two big meals and like two little snacks. But yeah, we have to kind of pace ourselves with this challenge, so wish me luck. Oh. More oatmeal. So I'm about to move on to meal number two here, and this is gonna call for another bowl of oats and a protein shake. Now, a lot of you guys watching this video are not hip to the magical recipe of pro meal. Rather than just having a scoop of protein with water and oatmeal, why don't we just combine the two? Hopefully Michael B. Jordan is watching this video so he can also use this recipe. In all seriousness, guys, literally all you need to make plain oatmeal like I ate in meal number one tastes amazing. With literally just two minutes and a few ingredients, add some sea salt, ground cinnamon, along with the scoop of protein powder you're gonna consume in a shaker bottle. Literally just put it in your oatmeal. This is gonna be vanilla flavored impact whey protein by my protein. Let me show you all exactly how I make this. One scoop of protein, some ground cinnamon, dash of sea salt, mix it all up, and bam, you've got yourself some protein. Okay, I know there's a lot of you guys that watch my full day of eatings on my YouTube channel and already know of this recipe, but if I could just teach one new soul this protein meal recipe, I promise it's gonna change your life, including Michael B. Jordan. But speaking about teaching a new soul a thing or two like this protein meal, a lot of you maybe don't know this. I am old 
always trying to give you all tips and tricks on how to save money when you're eating right. Like I showed you all that receipt in the very beginning of this video, but also more importantly, I'm trying to constantly save you money on supplements. I think far too many people spend way too much money on protein powders and supplements when they don't have to. So I spoke to my protein personally, myself, and they're giving you all 50% off your entire order for the next 48 hours. So take advantage of this flash sale. All you have to do is use the discount code ASEAL VIP at checkout. That's A-S-E-E-L VIP at checkout. So many of you guys already know that I always give you guys the biggest discounts on my protein, but I'll leave this specific whey protein powder linked in the description box down below, along with a link with my favorite supplements on the website that you can get for 50% off your entire order. Just drop that code of seal VIP and share this with your friends, your family member, because I'm tired of people wasting hundreds of dollars a month on supplements and they really don't have to. And then also when you pick this up, try out this pro meal recipe. <laughs> Is anyone else thinking what in the world right now? So what we have going on for meal number three is a cup of white rice, a sweet potato, eight ounces of chicken breast, four ounces of lean ground turkey, and a cup of broccoli. So two things that blow my mind here, okay? We have two protein sources, which is the chicken and ground turkey. And we have two carb sources, which is sweet potato and the white rice. That, my friends, is as Michael B. Jordan as it'll ever get. But anyways, I think that is the secret to Hollywood. Just have two of everything, you know? It might be something else actually what if it's like this one magic secret that they're keeping from everyone no no no, no. it's protein definitely protein that's the secret okay i haven't had ground turkey in a while i made a switch from ground turkey to ground beef like if you are used to 93 7 lean ground turkey try eating ground beef it is so much better like the fat content and protein content is the exact same but for some reason this just like tastes like misery and depression at least the chicken's cooked perfectly Ah, oh, protein sweats. Okay, giving myself some time to breathe in between the next meal and get some work done, but I have a very exciting phone call about to happen, so I'm about to talk to a huge manufacturer because I'm coming out with a huge project later this year. This is gonna be the biggest thing I have ever done. It's gonna be something you guys can touch, taste, and feel. I cannot wait to get it out for you, and I do appreciate all of your support, by the way, because it's mind-blowing that the fact that I can do a meeting like this and pretty much create this new product of mine that I can't wait to get out there. I want you all to guess what it is. I don't want to mention too much right now, but guess in the comment section down below. Maybe I'll do a giveaway in the future and, you know, just stay up to date with my videos. But seriously, thank you all so much. I cannot wait to get Project X. We're going to call it Project X. X, X, X. Hey, how's it going, Anthony? It's a seal. Yeah, in terms of the benchmark. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so excited. I've never done something like this in my life. And honestly, I'm also terrified. I feel like I'm about to shit my pants and I'm over the moon after that phone call, but can't wait to get Project X out to y'all as soon as possible. Stay up to date with my videos and vlogs and uh, we'll keep you up to date on. So if y'all thought it couldn't get any worse, huh? we have meal number four, which is gonna consist of eight ounces of tilapia, four ounces of ground turkey again. Then we also have another cup of white rice and a sweet potato. So tilapia and ground turkey. Michael B. Jordan, what are you on, bro? I don't think I've ever eaten turkey and tilapia at the same time. Also, I never eat tilapia. Like why in the world does anybody eat tilapia anymore? Like this is not 2008 bro science, guys. When in doubt, Michael B. Jordan it out. We got ground turkey and tilapia all in one. Remember when I told y'all earlier that I found the secret to these Hollywood physiques? Yeah, it wasn't that. It's tilapia and ground turkey in just one bite. That's how you get a body like The Rock. Now I get it. Not really. Okay, now we're really going crazy. We have ground turkey, white rice, and tilapia. It's honestly not that bad. It's just so bland. <laughs> Okay, we've officially moved on to a whole new level of protein sweats. That is going to be called protein sweats. I'm gonna finish this meal and then head to the gym in about an hour and a half from now because I have to let all this tilapia and ground turkey and chicken settle in or I'm going to absolutely destroy everybody in the gym. Anyways, I'll be taking you all through Michael B. Jordan's workout. So that's gonna be exciting. Stay tuned for that in about three, two, one. <laughs>
Ugh. Getting done with Michael P. Jordan's day one chest, back, and arms workout. I skipped the one mile jog as a warm up because who the hell wants to run when they're weight training? But I don't remember the last time I run, so we're not doing that. We did the rest of the exercises, and I definitely don't recommend this routine. Like, if you guys want to stick to a proper workout plan, try combining chest with arms, then do back with shoulders on another day. Or you could do a push pull routine. So you could do like chest, triceps, and shoulders together, back, biceps, and rear delts. So don't do chest, back, and arms together. You're not gonna look like Michael B. Jordan from Creed 3, I promise. Look, guys, if you want to follow these routines, like the PPLs I'm talking about, or the chest, arms, back, shoulders, it's all in my summer shredding program. I'll leave it linked first thing in the description box down below, just in case you guys want to get access to it. Anyways, that's going to wrap up the workout. Don't ever eat tilapia and lean ground turkey before you train, by the way. I've literally been bar Jordan's like on my ass about it. I'm sorry. I've been farting and tooting away the whole time, especially doing these push-ups. Physique update, like 250 grams of protein in. Seriously, though, this is my bulking physique. Like, I've been focusing on on gaining muscle lately. I'm around 176 pounds at 5'8". That's kind of a lot. I've never been that heavy. Let me know if I should like keep gaining muscle no, or really like yes. I feel like I should shred down Tell 10 him to pounds. Say. <laughs> she doesn't want no. me to get shredded. <laughs> about to indulge in meal number five and this is definitely my favorite meal for two reasons number one it's the least amount of food in all six meals in this diet plan and number two it actually does taste really damn good like y'all got to give this pro meal recipe a try i know there's probably tens of thousands of you that already have based on my full day of eatings when i show you all this but there's probably tens of thousands of you that have not so definitely give this a go don't just eat a cup of oatmeal and a protein shake like that is so depressing that is what michael b jordan's diet calls for but we're gonna do a little spin-off, all right? Like, come on, I need some sort of enjoyment here. <laughs> Oh, ha, ha. I've been eating oatmeal for the longest time ever. Like seriously, since I started my fitness journey, even since I was in college, oatmeal has been a staple in my diet, by the way. Like, do you guys eat oats? If not, definitely try to incorporate in your diet. It's such a filling food. And also, it's so versatile. You can make protein pancakes with it. If you see my full day of eating, you can make this pro oatmeal with it. You could do really a lot. Okay guys, so with Michael B. Jordan's diet, I'm starting to learn that there is a first time for everything, including shredded coconut on top of chicken breast and ground turkey and broccoli. So that's exactly what we got going on for meal number six. So we have chicken breast, more lean ground turkey, of course, two proteins, not just one. Then we also have a lot of broccoli and olive oil with shredded coconut on top. So two notes here. He's definitely having this meal without a bunch of sweet potatoes and more rice because towards the last meal of the day, he tried to include more fats and more protein and no carbs. Now, I don't really agree with that. You don't really just have to not eat carbs at night for many, many reasons. You can watch my other videos as to why, but also there's just like too much protein for this. You can have a high fat, high protein, low carb meal, but you don't need 80 freaking grams of protein, which is exactly what this meal has. Okay, Jordan, we have broccoli, shredded coconut, olive oil, and ground turkey. I feel really bad for what's about to happen tonight. <laughs> broccoli and shredded coconut. Okay, go for it. That's a real one, folks. <laughs> what do you think of it? Yeah. <laughs> Get yourself a girl that will eat broccoli with olive oil and shredded coconut. No! No! Yeah, no. I feel like you could totally make a chicken dish with some shredded coconut or something, but wow. Broccoli, olive oil, turkey, coconut. Do I need to say more? Oh. So listen to this. The total macros and calories in Michael B. Jordan's Creed 3 diet consisted of 3,941 calories coming from 390 grams of carbs, 100 grams of fat, and 357 grams of protein, guys. Even Michael B. Jordan, who's around 180 to 190 pounds, does not need 357 grams of protein. If you guys are wondering how much you need, because I literally get questions on this every single day on my Instagram, on my emails, in the comment section, you only need 0.8 up to one gram per pound of lean body mass. I recommend one, maybe even 1.1, 1 .1, but 350 is insane for someone that size. Look, I hope you all enjoyed this video, found it entertaining, found it helpful. Like I say in all my videos, I'm a type one diabetic living this lifestyle, doing what I do on a daily basis, helping inspire millions of you. Any of y'all can do anything. Thank you for watching. Smash the like button. If you did, subscribe if you're new. Hit the notification bell so you know when I upload new videos every single week. Thank you for watching. I'll see every single one of you in the next video.